In this presentation we are going to look at how to use the help function. So suppose I've read in the document there's or some code that there's this function called CBRT and I want to find out what it does. Now it's actually the cube root function but let's suppose I don't know that. What do I do to find out uh, what I could do with this uh, how this what happens with this. So what I'm going to do is write help CBRT and what that does it brings up a sort of help file for this function. So first off just starts off with a, a few basic remarks CBRT is a built-in function and here it tells us what the function actually does. Computes, com compute the real cube root, so it's the cube root of each element of x. So x is the sort of vector. So, or an array of numbers, or a group of numbers. So, there, just as a quick remark, it also will sort of specify that uh, if you take a different approach to solving the, the cube roots using the power function, power of one third, uh, then the results will be negative if x is negative. So, that's a sort of, uh, you know, it's always uh, handy to know these differences between different approaches. Uh, also, actually, was also quite interesting here is it brings up uh, some related functions, and sometimes these uh, related functions are probably more useful to what you're doing. So we have here the nth root, which is essentially the nth root. A uh, few quick remarks here. Uh, what we could do here is uh, additional help for built-in functions and operators is available in the online version of the manual. Use the command doc and topic to search the online in uh, the manual index and you also you can actually go to the mailing list and the website. So uh, what I'm going to do here is actually let's have a look at this nth root. So I'm going to clear the screen here and help there nth root and there we go there's the nth root and it computes the nth root of x returning real results for real components of x and again actually uh, it, put, it, it turns some related functions so we have for here we have the real square root square root cube root and so on anyway that is how we use the help function it's because it is a real treasure trove in using uh, matlab and octave